Charles from Sugarland has a question about a moldy mess. Well, he's he's looking for some cleaning advice, Tommy. You get right down to it. Charles writes, I have mold and mildew on my AC decks visible at the plenum and the air supply register. What's your recommendation for flexible duct cleaning, or should I consider just replacing the ducts altogether? What say you, Tom? Well, first off, he he asks. It's got a, He's he says he has mold or mildew for that matter on his return air a grill and he has it on the outside of the plenum which is pretty common and it has nothing to do with the ducts so my answer first off is you don't clean flex ducts you don't even touch the flex duct don't even consider that being the issue it's not coming from that now if you have flex duct that is broken it's old the the, the paper's coming off of it of course you would replace it you would never try to clean it or tape it unless it was only temporary, you'd end up replacing it. And that should be looked at and checked every time you have your spring checkup. If you have somebody good, they should do a visual inspection about all your duct work, whatever can be seen, and they will be able to have a recommendation whether it needs to be replaced or not. And replacing sections of flex duct is very easy. If it was so filthy and dirty for some reason, and we didn't really get into that in a question of this sort, then you would replace it. You would not even consider cleaning it. But on the outside of the plenum, if it's the outside, say, in your attic or in a closet somewhere, you just wipe it off. It's not a problem. It's not on the inside. It's because it sweats a little bit, you get a little dirt, and you get a little mildew growing on the metal. Not a big deal. Most people don't even worry about it because it's not in the living space, and it's not the inside of the air conditioner. If your plenum was getting really wet and gross on the inside, you would fix the problem and you would, would replace the plenum, not necessarily the ducts, because that's where all the, the problem is. But that's very rare. Plenum should last the life of the air conditioner, maybe two or three actually, and not ever have a problem. So I doubt that's the problem. You're thinking more of the outside. And as far as any of the registers or the grills, like the return air grill, you clean them like anything else. Most of them will come down, some of them come off. You clean them with a little bleach and water, dry them off, put them back up and they're clean. And that's exactly how we, you would clean it. So it's not a matter of having trucks and people and spending thousands of dollars. It's a matter of just a little household cleaning. And if just like anything, you dust your picture frames on the walls of your home, you dust your home, you vacuum, and you clean your registers once in a while because they get dirty. That's all it is. But it's was that complete? Well, yeah. Well, if, are you kidding? Covered it like a rug, brother. But I, I'm <laughs> curious. I'm curious about the thing that you said that, that you're sure it's mildew. How can I tell when I'm looking at it, Tom, if it's mold? Is that is it? Well, clearly- there's millions. Of, yeah, no. Mold grows on cellulose. It has to have a food, which is a wood. Your grill is not wood. Your ducts are not wood. Your uh, plenum is not wood. They're metal surfaces, usually metal. Now, it might be some kind of odd, very non-toxic, weird uh, mold, you know, little families of different things. But when people use the word mold all the time, they're thinking of these toxic molds like uh, penicilliums and stachybotrixes, and they have all these big fancy names. But there's only a few that are really harmful to people, and they usually grow on sheetrock, on studs, on sill plates, in the walls, any kind of cellulose. You need you need food, you need a damp space in some kind of water, and just like a human being, actually, food and water. And then, of course, damp, dark spaces, it allows the mold to grow, and it'll grow, you know, just do crazy stuff inside wall cavities and things. But on an air conditioning system, it's not the issue here. Here it is if you have a, a part or piece that's getting damp, wet, or it's growing some kind of schmutz on there, either replace it or you clean it or you don't worry about it if it's on the outside. But mildew is usually what you see. And mildew you can usually wipe off with your hand. If on that metal grill, if you took your finger and just wiped it, it probably comes right off. That's not a mold issue. All right. You want to know what your issues are? You want help with your issues? Go ahead and click on that Ask Tom button right there at homeshowradio.com. We'll help you out. We, you can send us form. You can fill out the form. You can send pictures. Whatever we need, whatever you need for us to help you, because Tom will post a new one every day. We post them at homeshowradio.com and um, our YouTube channel. Put them on there and our Facebook page.